everybody, I'm Delicia. Thanks so much for stopping by the Cigar Viction channel. So currently I am enjoying a cigar that has become an afternoon go-to for me, especially paired with a cup of coffee that's kind of like my little afternoon treat. Take a little time out, smoke a great cigar, and again, recently this has become a really nice go-to for me. So this is Warped Cigars' sister company, the Venture 1492. Um, cool cigar, a beautiful flavor, and I, th I thought I would just give you guys a little mini review of the cigar and talk about the five cigar set that it comes in that if you watch all the way to the end of the video, you can find out the details as to how you can score this beautiful five cigar set from Warped Cigars through my friends at CigarAndPipes.com. But again, I thought I'd go through and just kind of talk a little bit about the flavor notes on this cigar. I've said it on different videos, but I really wish there was a way to create some sort of a virtual aroma experience where you could actually just just take in the beautiful aroma because this cigar has it, um, even on just on the cold draw, smelling the foot before it's lit, it just has this beautiful look to it and this wonderful aroma. And I love the size offering, it's again, to me, this is a perfect mid-afternoon size. Of course, you could enjoy the cigar any time of the day, but for me, I love the Gran Corona Vitola that it comes in. This beautiful five and a half by 48. And when you look at the cigar itself, it has this beautiful, dark, rich espresso bean color to it. So it's just, for me, it's very inviting. It's slightly rustic looking. It has a lot of the leaf, the veins uh, that you can see in detail, but it's just, I, I personally like that. And I like the story behind it. Of course, the band itself, the little emblem, I think everybody by now knows what the 1492 stands for, but it has a, a picture on it and it's, um, it's pretty neat. I just like the whole, the whole display, the presentation, the story behind it. It's very cool. It also happens to have my favorite rapper, the Mexican San Andres and it's covering a beautiful, flavorful uh, binder, the Kotui binder, which not a lot of cigars have that. That's kind of one of those, you know, semi-unique uh, tobaccos that are, that are out there that's being used and when it's done properly, creates again, this wonderful marriage of flavors. And then the fillers are coming from both uh, Nicaragua and the Dominican Republic. So again, I mentioned the aromas that it has, but that pre-lit draw actually gives you this beautiful, um, this beautiful nuance of a kind of a cold brew coffee that I pick up. So again, for me, perfect for afternoon coffee time. Um, this is just a, a really nice pairing if you wanna go that route. So the cigar starts out initially with this beautiful slow dance between black pepper, cinnamon, there's a little bit of background of leather. You get some dark roast coffee uh, hints in there, as well as a subtle, subtle anise that you can pick up, but it's really nice. I would say it's solid medium body um, right from the start. So again, good flavor profile. You can smoke it by itself, water. You could do, um, I haven't tried it, but I'm sure you could do, you know, a rum, a bourbon, something dark, you know, to pair it with if you prefer to have it like in the evening or later afternoon. But again, for me, this goes great with coffee. So as you come into the second, third, of the cigar, not a ton of change. There has been a little bit more of a ramped up spice. So again, that that dance between the cinnamon and black pepper kind of turned a little faster, if you will. And those are the notes that I'm getting more so than how they kind of started out with like a nice little slow introduction. Again, they're kind of ramped up a bit at this point. Still a nice medium body. And I still pick up that, in, that nice anise that was there. It's a little bit turned up. Um, Again, good balance to it. To me, it has a little bit more sweetness than it started out with. There's almost a hint of a, of a light uh, cacao bean kind of in there. So not super sweet, but you get those little subtle hints of it. Still pick up some coffee. Um, again, just a really nice balanced, uh, good solid medium body, almost medium plus, but pr I would still call it like a nice medium body. So again, good for any time of the day. You could do it in the morning you know, mid-afternoon, like I have been, or even in the evening. And it did come as part of this nice little warped uh, five cigar set through my friends at cigarandpipes.com. So I wanna show you a little bit, 
a little bit of a closer look as to what else is in here. Love these cigars. You know, Warped is one of those brands that has a cool backstory. It's somebody that has a passion for cigars that, um, lucky for him, it's like, you have that passion and then other people share in it because you're making really good cigars and to watch his success continue has been, um, you know, such a joy. But these are really good sticks. <clears throat> so let me give you a little closer look as to what's inside here, aside from the one that I'm smoking, this beautiful uh, 1492. So you have this Maestro del Tiempo. And again, love the Vitola, that nice little Corona. It's featuring a Jalapa Nicaraguan Corojo 99 wrapper from Aganorsa, uh, Nicaraguan Condega for the binder. And then the filler is a mix of Criollo 98 and Corojo 99. You get the nice flavor notes of brown sugar, some maple, cedar, light pepper. And then La Hacienda. This was one I remember smoking it when it first came out and it was like, yes, this is, this does it. This was uh, like kind of a simplified, understated band, but um, I love this stick. So this is the La Hacienda, and it's another Corona. Um, again, love the Batola selection in here. These are right up my alley. Nicaraguan Corojo on the wrapper, and then Nicaraguan binder filler. You get the nice flavor notes of a mixture of some citrus, cream, leather, a little bit of cedar. Kind of has some sweetness that goes in and out. Then you have this cool little box press corto with a Nicaraguan shade grown Jalapa Corojo 99 for the wrapper, Nicaraguan Corojo 99 and Criollo 98 for the binder and then Nicaraguan filler. This one's pretty complex and bold. I love the boldness actually of the cigar. I would say this is a nice evening uh, smoke. You get little notes of chocolate, black pepper, caramel, cedar. This would be lovely with bourbon, with rum. Again, these are kind of my flavor note picks, uh, but I, I like that combination. Fourth up in the lineup, we have the Gran Reserva 1988. And this is a nice little Robusto, very traditional size, with a Nicaraguan shade grown Jalapa Corojo 99 wrapper, Nicaraguan Corojo 99 and Criollo 98 on the binder, again with the Nicaraguan filler, beautiful cinnamon, molasses, kind of a barnyard background, a little bit of an apricot and coffee mixture. So this one to me has a nice complexity, a nice mix of flavors, um, keeps you interested. This one's just a fun cigar to smoke. They all are actually. I say that about every cigar because I have fun smoking them. <laughs> and then of course the Venture 1492, which is what I'm smoking here. So I mentioned this nice little five cigar set from my friends over at cigarandpipes.com. I know I've done a couple videos now mentioning some of their different um, promotions that they offer. They're a cool cigar retailer that happen to be friends of mine. They really offer some nice promotional deals to my viewers. So I'm very appreciative of um, any time that they, you know, have anything special to offer you guys that I can turn back around and help you fill your humidors. So as you're actually watching this video, they are releasing this five cigar set, this warped five cigar set um, to exclusively for my Cigar Vixen viewers with a special discount. So the MSRP on this guy is 53 bucks, but again, for my Cigar Vixen viewers um, with some discounts mixed in there, it's actually gonna come out to 37.95 for this beautiful five pack. Um, they also have some cool swag. So again, for some of the I think it's like the first nine people that buy. There's some different swag items. Um, if you buy a couple packs, there's more additional swag. I'll put the details in the body of the video notes for you, but you can definitely just click on the link that I'll put on my Instagram, take you right over to their site and you can get yourself stocked up with some great cigars for your humidor. You know, I don't know where you are watching this video in the world, but where I am, Southern California, our weather has been interesting so like this morning for example it was cloudy overcast cold and i set the camera up you know and i'm kind of like doing my last minute getting ready getting the cigars and all that stuff and then i come out here and the sun as you can tell so i don't know how it's coming out on the video but the sun is shining out bright so it's it's kind of a fun uh time of year to try different cigars try different pairings with them again you can do like morning if you're really uh, you know a cigar person in the morning or you can venture out into like the more of the colder weather with the darker spirits you know your rums your bourbons and have a nice pairing or you can do like me and join your you know mid-afternoon with the sun shining and have that nice cup of hopefully tasa's coffee you know with your cigar but 
um, just a nice selection. And again, I'm always appreciative of my friends over there at cigarandpipes.com. They have some really cool deals already going on on their website and then additional ones for my Cigar Vixen viewers. So again, check out the notes in the body of the video and I'll also post it on my Instagram with a direct link right over to their website so you can you know, order stuff, whether you wanna try this five set that I'm recommending or maybe this and some other additional items with some of the additional um, discount that they're offering for you guys. So hopefully you guys um, like that, appreciate it like I do. Um, sometimes it's hard to find a reliable source to order cigars from. Uh, again, anytime I order from cigarandpipes.com, I'm receiving the cigars in a really good time frame. They're uh, properly packaged. They're ready to be smoked or go right into my humidor. Uh, there's no issue there. So that's one of those things that I think is very important because not all online retailers are, are equal. <laughs> So again, a trusted source um, that I like to pass on that information to you guys. And I swear this aroma is just, it's one of those cigars that's so inviting. I was just having this conversation with somebody recently about how not all cigars are created equal and certain cigars just have that aroma that, I mean, you could be walking down the street and you'll pick up some of it and it's just like, yes, where is that? Where can I get it? Um, I love that aroma and this one has that um, the flavor notes are, again, not you're not going to pick up a lot of crazy uh, noticeable changes as you get through each third, but it's just really balanced. And all those flavors that I mentioned, they kind of start out, uh, you know, here and then it kind of gradually increases in those flavors as you get through all the way to, you know, when you come into that final third, you're still getting those nice uh, cinnamon and black pepper spice, the notes of coffee, a little bit of chocolate, little bits of cedar, the nuttiness, and then that anise that's in the background. So just a lovely stick. Um, again, Warp Cigars is one of those brands that you can tell when somebody is making cigars because they have a passion for it. And then when you add the knowledge to blend properly and you have good quality tobacco, um, you have uh, just a fabulous outcome. And so highly recommended that you give this one a try, that, that you give the five cigar set also a shot, maybe get a couple of them. It's a really good deal. And again, a nice excuse to stock up your humidor. Maybe you share some with friends. Maybe you keep them all for yourself. No judgment. But either way, I hope you guys are smoking something fabulous. I love the time that we can spend together. Thank you so much for tuning in. And um, feel free to post any comments below if you have any questions about these cigars in particular. Um, if there is one of the four that I showed you that you really wanna see me review, um, I'm thinking of maybe doing another review out of one of these cigars in this pack because they're a really good set. So again, drop them in the comments below what you'd wanna see reviewed. And thanks again so much for tuning in and hanging out with me for a little bit. I hope you all are doing well and I can't wait to see you soon. Cheers.